Yes, Namibia prepares for joining the rest of the world tomorrow to commemorate the International Day of Human Rights. The Office of the Ombudsman launched a five-year National Human Rights Action Plan. It is aimed at improving the promotion and protection of human rights in the country. President Hifike Punyepohamba was invited to launch the action plan, which he described as an important tool for maintaining human dignity, peace and stability in the country, but was quick to point out that Namibia suffered from human rights violations as a result of the atrocities that were committed by the German and South African colonialists before independence. Our people feel that they are being discriminated against because they have no access to land. The land is owned by the children of those who came to colonize us. The president says he sometimes gets emotional when talking about the human rights violations by the colonial masters because he has witnessed various atrocities that were committed against the Namibians as they fight for their rights. And we were talking against the white people who came from Europe to come and colonize us here. I said, go and visit the monument that we put up there. It is depicting the truth of what had happened in this country. People are being hanged. Today, those who did that, they appear to be the champions of human rights. The president also revealed that there are certain farmers that are planning to take government to court regarding land tax, which he says is uncalled for because it is aimed at collecting revenue of ensuring that all Namibians have access to land. He called on those with a large piece of land to take part in the action plan for it to succeed. The action plan focuses on the right to health, education, housing, water and sanitation, justice and the right to non-discrimination focusing on vulnerable groups. Tonaten Shidudu, NBC News, Vinduk.